Hi there, this is Chris with CAD Dimensions and welcome to another tech tip. Sometimes, especially after an upgrade, the SOLIDWORKS submenu that you would expect to see within Windows File Explorer may be missing. This contains some useful file functions, so today we'll be going over how to restore that functionality. As you can see here, the submenu is not showing correctly. I'm currently using Windows 11, so your menu may appear slightly different to mine, but they have the same essential options. To restore the submenu requires a registry edit. To perform this edit, open the Start menu, type regedit, and run as administrator. In order to ensure that all possible causes have been resolved, there are nine potential registry keys that you should reset. In order to reset them, we recommend adding underscore old to the end of the file name so that the keys are not deleted until necessary while still accomplishing the same purpose as far as the software is concerned. We will repeat these steps for each of the registry keys. In order to rename them, you right click and select rename. As I said, repeat this for each of the nine listed registry keys. It is entirely possible that you may not need to reset all of them. However, we recommend doing all of them so that you don't need to piecemeal go back and forth between and do trial and error to get this to work. These should be the nine keys it takes to restore any and all functionality to that submenu. After those nine have been renamed to their name underscore old, we will go to our list of installed programs and run a repair of SOLIDWORKS. In order to do that, we will navigate to our list of installed programs in the newer versions of Windows. This is called Apps and Features. Click on the three dots to the right and select Modify. This error can safely be ignored and choose the radio button to repair your installation. Depending on your particular setup, this may take more or less time and it should only be necessary to check the box for SOLIDWORKS, in our case 2023 SP0.1. We will jump ahead now in order to avoid waiting around for this to complete. After the repair is completed, you should navigate back to the file location and you should be able to right click on the selected file and see the SOLIDWORKS submenu restored. As you can see, it shows the SOLIDWORKS logo there. And when I hover over SOLIDWORKS here, I now have the SOLIDWORKS submenu again with that functionality and I'm all set to go. If you run into any issues with this or any other problems at all, feel free to reach out to CAD Dimensions and submit a support case and our support team will be more than happy to get back to you and assist you with all of your needs and get you up and running and get the software working how you need it. Have a great day.